Welcome to the Tradex Foods 3-Minute Market Insight. This is Robert Ryerson and here's the Seafood News for Monday, October 19th, 2015. El Nino strikes again as the squid, California squid fishery dries up. Pacific Loligo squid have been dramatically impacted by the warm water effects of El Nino. The California coastline is a hot spot for El Nino, which is set to get worse in the winter months ahead. The Loligo fishery started strong, but as the squid began to move to cooler and deeper waters, many fishermen were just out of luck. Around 30,000 metric tons have been caught in California so far, leaving 85,000 metric tons, or approximately 65% of the quota remaining until March 2016. When fishing began to slow down, only smaller sizes like 12 to 14 piece per pound were harvested. Larger sizes have been seen in the northern regions near San Francisco, but not recently. Current squid prices are on the incline if you can find product. Orders were taken at $1.08 a pound for 1x10 packs delivered to Europe, which is expected to rise. European customers are scrambling to secure squid inventories after the low landings in California and the early shutdown of the Patagonian squid fishery in the Falkland Islands and Argentina left them short. The Patagonian fishery runs July to September but closed early September due to poor catch. Our Tradex Live offer the week, week is Sinbad Platinum individually packed coho salmon fillets, number one quality, trim sea and good meat color. This product is packed 1 by 25 in Vancouver with 25,000 pounds available at $4.05 a pound US. Click or tap the icon above to view this offer. This isn't the first time the El Nino has shifted squid ec ecosystems. Humboldt squid migrated north in the late 1980s becoming crab bait for Oregon fishermen. Displacement brings new market opportunities as the fishery shifts, but this doesn't happen overnight. Many Californian squid processors have actually closed their doors, but other larger fishing companies are optimistic for the winter months to bring cool waters back to the region. In the meantime, the market is on the standby as the wait list for squid customers continues to grow. We'll give you another update once the squid start to return to the California coast. Thank you for joining me for the Tradex Foods 3-Minute Market Insight. This is Robert Ryerson. Buy smart and eat more seafood.